Uh, not the biggest sports headline tonight. No, <laughs> earlier today, BYU trying to become the first team to win at Was uh, Wisconsin, a non-conference opponent, since 2003. It's been a long time, so let's go to the highlights, show you what happened. Camp Randall, we go. BYU trying to become the first one. 40 straight wins, 41 wow. straight wins against non-conference opponents. Second possession for the Badgers, that's Taiwan Deal in for the two-yard touchdown, 7-0 Wisconsin. Next possession for the Cougars, here comes Squally Canada busting loose. And Squally's got a 44-yard game, bad to the Badgers, 28. Uh, three plays later, why not give it to the guy who got you there, right? Squally. He'll finish it off the final three yards. Cougars tied up at seven. They can upset, right? Yeah. Second quarter, Tanner Mangum to Aleva Hifo. It's a double pass. Moroni Laulu Putatau wide open. How about that? 31-yard touchdown. BYU has a 14-7 lead. Now really thinking about upset. But late in the second quarter after BYU missed a field goal, Jonathan Taylor takes it across for the two-yard touchdown, and we're tied at 14 at the half. Third quarter, Alex Hornibrook, quarterback for Wisconsin. Picked off by Zane Anderson, and Anderson returns to 12 yards to the Badgers 27. Cougars capitalize off that turnover. Guess who? Canada! And BYU <laughs> regains the lead 21-14. Start of the fourth quarter. Badgers pounded in again. Deal again. And again, we're tied this time at 21. Ten minutes left in the fourth. Here comes Skyler Southam on for the 45-yard field goal to take the lead. Good. Cougars have the lead 24-21. Now we're really thinking upset, right? Hold on, 41 seconds left. Rafael Gaglioni, uh, one of the best kickers in the country, 42-yarder to tie. It's head left. No good. He missed it. Celebration for Cougars. They pick up their first road win against a ranked team in 12 years. 24-21, your final. Our guys played well. We, our coaches prepared really well, too, and um, had a good week of practice, you know, and our guys just believe. I mean, we, it, they played out like we told them it was going to, and we had the feeling that it would be close the fourth quarter. We thought we should have some fun, let loose, and uh, it's probably the most loose I've seen these guys, and, and that was a good thing for us. The team wanted it. I mean, it was a shock to, the, to everybody else, but deep down the side, we knew we was going to win. Look, look at Kalani uh, in that locker room. Yeah, a lot of people are saying this is the uh, probably one of the top three wins in BYU oh, history. Oh, absolutely. 